students a very good morning to all of you and i know you all are doing well at home and you are obeying your elders your sister your brother your mummy and papa and your teachers also i know that and you are very good boy and girl so now children today i'm going to teach you a new topic that is multiplication okay children multiplication now what is multiplication can anyone tell me what is multiplication yes multiplication is a repeated addition multiplication is a repeated addition suppose now see on the blackboard suppose there are two kites in one cloud or in one box another box has two kites and another box has two kites so how many kites are all yes so 2 plus 2 plus 2 is equal to 6 so there are total kites are 6 okay children now let's see another example now see three toffees how many toffees are there one two three there are three toffees in one box another box has also three toffees one two and three yes and another box also has three toffees one two and three so how many toffees are total there count three plus three plus three Three plus three plus three is equal to nine. So this is very lengthy process, है ना? It's very lengthy process. Three plus three plus three plus three. So this is called multiplication operation. This is called multiplication operation, or we can write this in a short form. That is three into Three is equal to nine. Okay, children. Now this is the short form, or we can say this multiplication. This is the repeated addition of multiplication. This is called multiplication operation. Now this is the short form, and we can say this multiplication sentence. Okay, children. Now see, this is the symbol of multiplication. this is the cross cross is there na so this is called multiplication symbol or okay, sign okay children now see there are two ways to write the multiplication and what are they let's see two ways to write multiplication suppose we will write like this 5 into 2 5 into 2 is equal to 10 this is called horizontal multiplication horizontal multiplication okay children now one more thing i just want to remind you that we can read as we can read this as 3 times 3 is 9 3 multiplied by 3 is 9 or Three threes are nine, so we can say this in a three ways or three uh, forms. Okay, now there are two ways or uh, two ways to write this operation. So what are this? Two multiplied by two. Sorry, five multiplied by two is equal to ten. Okay, this is called horizontal multiplication. right children yes now see this is the another way to write sum 5 into 2 is called or is 10 this is called vertical multiplication if we write like this this is called vertical multiplication okay children now see the first number in this the vertical operation or vertical ways that we uh, 
say this the first number is called multiplicand called multiplicand the number that uh, the number that multiply by another number is called multiplicand okay and the second number is called multiplier the second number is called multiplier the number by which another number is multiplied by that is called multiplier okay and the answer 5 to the 10 the 10 is the answer here of the sum so this is called the product the product okay children understand the sums by doing this operations okay now the question is find out the product okay find out the product first we have to cut or we have to solve the ones house okay so now see 3 23 multiplied by 3 so first we will cut or we will solve this ones house so 3 times 3 is 9 okay now next is tens house so we will cut the next operation is tens so 3 times 2 is 6 okay okay children now see the product the answer is 69 23 multiplied by 3 is the answer is 69 okay now see the next who will do first come yes now 42 multiplied by 4 so first we will cut one's house so what is the one's house 2 times 4 or 2 multiplied by 4 or 4 multiplied by 2 is the answer is 8 okay now 4 times 4 is 4 4 is a 4 4 is a 16 yes so one number we will write in one block so the answer is 168 okay 42 multiplied by 4 is answer is the product is 168 okay children now see the next uh, sum this is the three digit sum okay this is the same manner we have we will do 5 125 multiplied by 5 so first we will solve the ones house right so there are two digits so what we will do we will carry over one number to tens house okay so 5 5 is a 25 2 once I will write here and 2 will go here okay so now see next is the tens house we will solve the tens house 5 2 is a 5 2 is a 10 yes then 5 2 is a 10 plus 2 the so 5 2 is a 10 plus 2 is equal to 12 so 12 we will write 2 here and 1 will go in 10's house ok children see then we will cut or we will sum 100's house ok so 5 1's a 5 so 5 1's a 5 plus 1 5 1's a 5 plus 1 is equal to 6 ok so this way we will do so the answer will be 625 125 multiplied by 5 is the product will be 600 to 625 I hope you are understanding now see let's do the another sum now see 346 
multiplied by 2 ok so we will do first 1's house so 2 6 are 2 6 are 12 yes so 2 6 are 12 and we will write 2 here and 1 will go up in 10's house ok so now next is a 10's house we will uh, solve the 10's house 2 4's are 2 4's are 8 8 may plus 1 we will add this number ok so 2 4's are 8 8 plus 1 that is 9 so we will write here number 9 ok children now see next is 2 hundreds house so 2 3's are 2 3's are yes 2 3's are 6 so we will write here 6 ok now the question is 346 multiplied by 2 the project the answer will be 692 ok children I hope you have understood the practice makes man perfect if you will do practice very soon you will get all the answers the, uh, you should understand the concept also ok children now I will catch you in next video and uh, hope you all are ok hope you have understood this please do practice at home ok tata bye bye take care god bless you all